Gladiomenthes, flatworms, simplest of the worms, approximately 25,000 species. The head region contains two simple brains or ganglia, which are simply bundles of nerves. Two nerve cords run down the sides of the worm. There is no respiratory, skeletal, or circulatory system. They do have one or two pairs of simple eyes, which are sensitive to light. They have a closed digestive system with a mouth where food enters and wastes exit. The closed gut branches so the food reaches all parts of the body. Some are free living, planarians. Some are parasitic, flukes and tapeworms. A planarian with simple eye-like structures which are sensitive to light. If a planarian is cut, they have the ability to regenerate the missing parts. Roundworms, nematoda, long, slender, snake-like body, the movement is whip-like. They have an open digestive system, mouth where food enters, and an anus where waste exit. Estimate 40,000 species found in nearly every ecosystem. Anelida, segmented worms, over 22,000 species, long, segmented bodies divided by ring-like constrictions. Most have setae, which are movable bristles found on the segments of these worms. They have a long digestive system, to a tube with a mouth where food enters, being pulled in by a muscular pharynx. This system in Anelida may include a crop where food can be stored, a gizzard for grinding food, an esophagus, and a long intestine. Annelids are more complex than the other worms. They have more developed organ systems, muscular circulatory and nervous systems. Earthworms and leeches are annelids. This segmented worm has a long proboscis or tubular mouth part. This one has a hand-like structure at the posterior end of the worm which functions as gills for respiration. 